Due to impacts of COVID-19 epidemic, many have lost their jobs and struggled to make ends meet. Along with the efforts exerted by the city to assist people, many charitable community services have been carried out. In particular, charitable kitchens that operate every day are helping to relieve people's hardships in this difficult time. Although it's summertime for school children, the kitchen of Ngo Wing Primary School still operates. Over the past few weeks, the kitchen has become a charity address with thousands of meals delivered to the poor every day. School staff of about 30 people gathers from 5 a.m. to prepare meals and deliver essentials. We help lottery ticket sellers on the street, the elderly, the disabled and those in hardships because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Not only providing free meals thanks to the kind donations of Ngo Wing Primary School teachers, but the Zero Dome Market has also been opened to help the poor with their expenses during the difficult time of the pandemic. This Zero Dome Market helps me a lot with my daily expenses. As a scrap collector, I struggle to make ends meet every day. I can manage for another month thanks to this activity. Dozens of charity kitchens are operating across Gunter City to spread the solidarity spirit and relieve the hardship caused by the pandemic. Free and affectionate meals were timely delivered to people in need. To raise funds and resources for the Zero Dome Market, we mobilize voluntary donations from the teachers of Ngo Wing Primary Schools and other schools in Ningyu and many philanthropists. Some disadvantaged people teared up when they received presents, which makes me want to cry tears of joy too. As long as the complicated and unpredictable developments of COVID-19 pandemic continues, the fire of love will be lit at the charity kitchens in Gunther City with sparks of kindness from philanthropists and kind-hearted people serving the community and compatriots. <laughs>